Have you ever seen an opening that portrays the themes and characters this well? Because I know I haven't. Well today I'm here to tell you how this opening made me realise what the themes of Hell's Paradise are without reading the manga. But I'm also going to be telling you how much I love this opening. I have never experienced an opening that can be so vividly beautiful, yet so drastically dangerous. What do I mean by that? Well take a look at this shot. It's so vivid with colours, but, but then, then there's, there's two, two heads morphing! Vividly beautiful yet so drastically dangerous. You get my vibe? But then we get the same type of shots with a little bit of symbolism. The spooky, beautiful atmosphere that is given to us when our boy Gabimaru Fuck that name sounds so cool! is depressingly looking down from the clouds of blood all over him is just so beautiful. Which shows that even if he dies, he'll still be looking down from heaven with regret. Then on the next cut, when Sagiri Another cool name! Is drawing her sword with blood all over her is somehow also beautiful. But when you take in that shot, it's actually depressing. Sagiri has blood all around her, which indicates that death was always around her when she was a kid. But the only thing shining and unstained by blood is her sword. Which shows that her sword is her life. She goes by the sword. High key depressing when you take it in, eh? It's so colourful and beautiful, but it's a creepy and bloody atmosphere. This opening just oozes so much creativity. And it's like that with the song. At first I thought the song was from a band that has two singers, but it's actually two separate artists. A duet of Millennium Parade and... Uh, uh, Sheena Ringo? I have no idea who the both of them are. Yep. I'm new to Japanese music, so if they're like high names, like high top tier people, I, I'm sorry, I just don't know who they are. <laughs> so I'm just gonna avoid this now and say, damn do they work well together. The fact that both entities together make the song so hauntingly strong is amazing. I'm new to this series, but this dangerous airy vibe from the song is indicating what this series is gonna be like. Hauntingly beautiful. But when that pause happens right before the chorus, I get chills. It takes my breath away and once that chorus drops all my air comes rushing back to me and I am vibing with death. Cause ayo the song is a killer. Especially when you read the lyrics. I was able to pick up the themes for the anime through them. Life and death. Redemption. Morals and ethics. Power and control. I believe these are the themes for the show. There's going to be people fighting to death for the redemption of their past mistakes, whilst also following the ethics of the elixir of life. Do they think it should be needed? Do they think it shouldn't be not? So people will use their power and control over other people so they can have the benefits of surviving on the beautiful vivid island. Some will see it as their utopia, others will see it as their chance to redeem their lives, and others the chance to kill. But another thing I picked up is duos. A lot of the people in this opening are in duos. It looks like duos is going to be a theme throughout the show. Maybe there'll be a split of the four themes I picked up just before. A duo might be life and death. One does not want to kill, but the other is a brutal murderer. One wants redemption, but the other just wants to leave peacefully on the island. One has ethics and the other does not care. One has power over the other one who lives in fear below him. I feel like that's definitely going to be in the show. This truly seems like a perfect opening for the series. The visuals are gorgeous, accompanied by stunning yet somewhat haunting music, which when both are put together shows the themes of the show if you pay the right amount of attention. But if you aren't paying much attention, you are still being visually and audibly satisfied with what has been given to us. A perfect opening. I now understand why it's called Hell's Paradise. Now what's your favourite part of this opening? Mine is the compatibility of the two singers. It works way too well. Like I want a full album from the both of them because it just, it just, oh my god, they just sound so amazing together that they need to make a full album. But from the dark twisted beautiful visuals to the hauntingly beautiful vocals, we got this. A masterpiece by Millennium Parade, Sheena Ringo and Mappa. But yeah, other than that, hope you guys all have a great day. Keep smiling, be happy out there, because I want you to be okay. God damn it! And yeah, other than that, peace.